Welcome to Drawfee, where we take dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Nathan. I'm Tristan. I'm Jacob. I'm Julia. And if Tristan's here, that must mean we're delving into another lore-filled world oh on this episode. Boy. You got it. It's time for... Fantasy. Dragon Quest. Oh, nope. Final Fantasy. <laughs> <laughs> here we are. You got it a That's, little wrong. Give me one second here. Just need to come up with uh, three brand new monsters. Okay. 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 I know there's a new Final Fantasy 14 expansion. Everyone's excited about Shadow Final Fantasy. Shadowbringers. Shadowbringers. Sure. Yeah. Shadow bringer. Everyone's a shadow bringer on a sunny day. Bring the shadows. On a sunny day, everybody's uh -huh. bringing some shadows. Cause oh, you brought your shadow with you, huh? <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Actually, I have to everywhere physically <laughs> in this universe. Well, lame. I had to do one of those shadow bringer comedy shows where you had to bring like 15 shadows to get to perform, and each mm -hmm. one had to buy a drink. <laughs> had to buy two drinks each. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, you know, with Final Fantasy VII Remake also on the horizon here, maybe, potentially, it seems like a good time to, to dive into some bosses, which we've never done. We've never done a Final Fantasy episode before? What the hell? We've been doing, we, we did our bad JRPG episodes where uh -huh. we made our own. Yeah, it really is insane that we've not done a Final <laughs> Fantasy episode. I think I just assumed that we had. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's one of the, yeah, it's one of those ones that, like, we may as well have already done it so there was no point to actually do it sure but we're doing it anyway let's do it let's do it okay well, i'm gonna give you some final fantasy bosses challenge you to draw them and then we'll see what uh they look like and how wrong that that you got them there. sounds good all right nathan you are first yes um <clears throat> your final fantasy boss good king mogulmog the 12th <laughs> oh oh 12th of his name <laughs> uh, the 12th good king yeah, good of Mogulmog. Mog Mogulmog. And this is an enemy? It's a boss. It's, it's a, a boss. boss. It's a, a good, boss. He's a you good have to fight the good king? I'm going to start with a crown. Okay. He, is he not actually good, or are we the bad ones? Question mark. Which Final Fantasy? There are so many Final, Final Fantasy the 14th. Okay. Uh, oh, this is from 14. Yeah, okay. and also it was in the original 14, and then it made it to A Realm Reborn. Is well. 14 the one with the, the good boys on a road trip? That's, That's 15. 15. Okay. You Idiot. Okay. How dare you? How 14, dare you? 14 is uh, Final Fantasy like online. It's basically uh, Final Fantasy 11 2. Yeah. Is that helpful? <laughs> it's the Momo. <laughs> <laughs> 11-2. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, the second MMO describe, in the Final Fantasy universe. Describe this good king. I finished what? his crown. I mean. I think it's pretty good. He has any moves? He has any lore? Oh, he's got lore. This is going to be a good king. So the king... Uh, Lived up in up in the heavens, uh, and and the king and his uh, servants served the gods. Sure, mm -hmm. but then at some point they they wanted to go down and live with mortals in peace. Mm -hmm. So uh, all the subjects sort of went down there, and uh, he he held a rope because uh, they all have wings, but they can't. He's got wings. This king's got wings. I mean, his subjects have wings. He's so. a wing. He's a wing king. He could be a wing king. He's a bird. Uh, he's a, yeah, he's a bird. <laughs> this is a bird. Good King Mogul Mog the Twelve is a is a bird for sure. <laughs> it's a bird, okay. Uh, so, you know. so basically, what had had to happen in like true like fable kind of fashion, uh, you're just making the Onion what? King from Overcooked. I want you to know that. That's true. It does look like him. <laughs> he's not a bird, is he? No. Well, he's an onion. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a bird. This is the Bird King, Mogul sure. Mog. Okay, so they went down. They, to, had they the went rope. down. Well, uh, so they they're up in the heavens, and the king holds the rope while they all climb down to the earth. But since the king's holding the rope, the king doesn't have any way to get down. So the king made the ultimate sacrifice. Basically, everyone else got to go to paradise, but the king. And then you go up to heaven and beat his ass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, no, no. What happened <laughs> later? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna read this part from the wiki because it's so indecipherable. Yeah, yeah. Just, just ages later, at the dusk of the sixth astral era, and again during the seventh umbral, the guard of the Twelves Wood, sw the sworn defenders, grow grow worried about the threats to the Twelves Wood, and they feel compelled to bring Mogulmog to Eorzara at last via a ritual taught to them by the masked stranger who approached them. Okay. Is that any of that helpful? So the Twelves Wood. The Knights of the Twelves would mm -hmm. the guardian, the do guards, the ritual yeah. mm -hmm. to get this sad bird uh -huh. 
who's who is I mean, stuck up in heaven. <laughs> Wait, I okay. Question. Well, but, mm, the sacrifice was okay. that he had to stay in heaven. They didn't want to be there clearly, so it must not have been that great. Yeah, because right now it kind of just sounds like guess I'll make the ultimate sacrifice. Well, there was oh, a, staying in the good oh, one. Dang, well, there was I a guess war. There was a war Ooh. in the in the the, the churning mists. I, I believe is that heaven. I think so. Okay. Maybe. Yes. All right. Yeah. I'm Tristan, say, you're supposed to know the stuff, look, so we can ask. Look. Why don't you know everything about everything? Well, you know what? I am right about everything. Nobody check. Just trust me. <laughs> I there did we think we were doing Dragon Quest, so I looked everything up just now, seconds later. Uh, <laughs> right, but we did establish that earlier in the episode. We That's did good. establish that yep. as what we call a, a callback, everyone. Yes, it's pretty Very good. Please enjoy. Everything I say is correct. Mm-hmm. I have never been wrong, and I will never be wrong. All right, give me give me some of this guy's attacks. Attacks. Um, well, the attacks are- He's uh, holding he's the He's got a lot of uh, guardians, uh, the, a, lot of, a lot of guards. Is it the Twelves Wood? him. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Why Why not? So they summoned him down because mm-hmm. they thought people were going to attack the Twelves Wood. Mm-hmm. And then you, you, the player, do attack the Twelves Wood and beat his ass. Well, uh, It seems like he hasn't done anything to deserve an ass beating. Well, He's just what, a friendly what bird king. They find, a, they find a way to summon him. Yeah. The ki- their king. And they keep doing it, and it gets like worse and worse as it goes on. Oh. Um, right. So he is a, he's a primal, and in the Final Fantasy fourteen universe, that's more or less like an Esper or like a a summon, like okay. uh, Ifrit and Shiva. Oh, and yeah. so he's got like way more details than than what yeah. I've drawn. You got. I mean, I mean, I I was gonna ask for more lines, but yeah, I'm just okay. more lines. Here, well, I've just, just here here got him. I've just got him wearing his sort of bird king robe. I was really expecting some sort of like uh, very painterly like. Uh, a mono type uh, drawing here, and I feel like I'm not getting that. Yeah, why can't you draw as good as Yoshitaka Amano? Nathan? In, t- in ten minutes. In please. ten minutes. <laughs> Does he have like one of them ridiculous swords? <laughs> Nathan completely ignores our bet. <laughs> 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 Throw that one wow, right in the nice trash. Dodge. Let's nice talk dodge about the, the sword. <laughs> I don't know how to do an Amano. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to do one. I'll I'll put I'll put a a here, here here's what we'll do. Is this is this what you want? Is this what you guys want? I don't know what you're doing. I don't, I don't know, know if doing. it's what I want. Like one of these. It's not working. It didn't work. Hold on. <laughs> is this what you guys want? Is this what you guys want? <laughs> a lot of frantic clicking. <laughs> yeah, no, this is good. Oh, Look that's that. pretty good. Great. Like that. Yeah. Great. Now it looks like a logo. A final a final logo. Great. I, uh, oh, it's because the opacity's here. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God, now I can't Come see on. it at all. What are we doing here? <laughs> Is this good? No, take that away. Okay. Keep drawing. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> what is like wild to me, and like I don't think we can really play it because of like m- music licensing issues, but if you look up the the theme, you just YouTube it for... Uh, Good King Muggle Mog's theme. It's literally this is Halloween from Nightmare Before <laughs> Christmas. It's like it's like a it's, a, it's such a hardcore ripoff. It's like pretty hilarious. Is he a Halloween man? I mean, not really. He, he sounds like a big dumb goofball. I mean, he's like the, there's like the Pumpkin King and the Muggle King. I guess mm. is he a Moogle? Is he a Moogle? What does it sound like? I mean, it sounds like he is. Oh, okay, I got it. <laughs> so get, get that thing on his head. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Good King Moggle Mog. Oh, and Mog- Moogles use guns, so this needs to be a gun sword. What? I don't think they what? do. What are you do- what are I don't think Moogles use about? guns. Moogles use guns? When? In Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. What? Tactics Advance? <laughs> yeah. It's not canon. <laughs> <laughs> We're not talking about Ivalice here. We're talking about Grimoire of the Rift over here. <laughs> Come on, War the Lion's ass, Moogle. <laughs> Come on. All right, so no gun. <laughs> He's a bird still. I think there are some guns in Final Fantasy XIV, though. That sounds there's right. There's like a mechanist class that yeah. uses like machines and shit. And there's also like, you can get a mount that's just like the car from Final Fantasy XV. Yeah, everyone can be riding around in the car <laughs> from Final <laughs> Fantasy XV. It's really funny. Everyone's like hopping up and down yeah, in their cars. In their cars. <laughs> I also saw in the new one they're adding a uh, like a class that uses gun blades, mm. like, oh, squall, like squall, like squall do. Finally, yeah. 
finally like a, a sword what has a gun in it. It's a sword what has a gun in it. Can you can you explain to me how a gun blade works? No. I just want to know because <laughs> it seems like the the trigger is underneath the blade, so it seems like the bullet would shoot right out into the blade itself. Yeah, Squall's sword gun doesn't really make sense. There are like historical sword guns though, okay. but usually the blade like. Yeah. Is on a is on a hinge so it can bend back so the I gun see. can be revealed instead uh-huh. of shooting directly into the weapon. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't get it. It's like magic? Does it split the gun? I think it just split runs purely on cool energy. <laughs> <laughs> it's in that it's just cool. Mm-hmm. And so if you if it's cool enough, it just works despite all evidence to the contrary. Mm-hmm. Did I do it? This looks like a sad bird king. Yeah. It's a good it's a good king. It's a good king. He's I a would, good king. I would definitely get together he with like a, some of my friends he, and beat this guy's ass. He got a star. <laughs> for sure. He got a star for being the best king. And now he's about to get a star for, for getting destroyed. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna get wrecked. He's gonna get wrecked, because I need that loot. I need that sweet loot. <laughs> I'm gonna look him up. Yeah. Yeah, I wanna see what he looks like. He's just a big moogle. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> he's giant. I don't. Why well, don't want to fight him? <laughs> you gotta. Why? Well, because you, know, you gotta heard, fight the twelfth wood. I read an interesting story about why they made him. Okay. There's a cool article on uh, Kotaku by Jason Schreier about they were going to launch some bosses for Final Fantasy XIV, a Leviathan and a Titan, but then the uh, March 11th earthquake and tsunami happened, and those are the powers of those two bosses. Oof. They're like, oh shit, oh we can't do this. This is real bad. Uh, what's the opposite of everything? It's a Moogle. It's a giant Moogle. Beat it up. <laughs> it's a giant Moogle there's king. Go no, hit it. There's no chance a natural disaster in real life involving a giant Moogle will happen. <laughs> no. Exactly. Hopefully. So exactly. we'll just make it. Well, I like my sad bird. I, I like him it. too. It's I nice. would follow this king. He's got the little rope still. Yeah, he's, he's holding on to the rope. Jacob's turn. Yeah, let me go. All right, Tristan. Boss me up, my dude. All right, you're going to be bossed up. You will be your Final Fantasy bosses, Hurley, Larry, and Mo. <laughs> Aww, the three stooges. You get to draw the stooges from the... What? Jacob no. just made the saddest groans and tilted his head back to the heavens. I was so ready to draw so many things, and not I'm not ready to draw the three fucking stooges. <laughs> What about Shemp? <laughs> Remember Shemp? What about Shemp? What is Shemp? <laughs> Sometimes they had Shemp. No, they didn't. Um, <laughs> Sometimes so they had Shemp. They sure did. Where do I even begin? <laughs> um, Three so heads, I when guess. When they were between so, curlies, so this curly kept dying. They they are known as the Dream Stooges. Uh, <laughs> not Dream Stages. Dream Stooges. Dream Stooges from Final Fantasy VI. Great. And later on, they changed their names. That's what that is on Super Nintendo back when it was Final Fantasy III, technically. Uh, it was uh, Curly Larry and Moe, and obviously they changed it because, come on. Mm-hmm. Uh, so now their names are, are you ready for this? Uh, Curlax, <laughs> Laragorn. Laragorn. <laughs> that's, that's more <laughs> copyrighted stuff. No, it's Larry plus Aragorn. Very yeah. creative. And then there's also Mobius as well. Oh, oh my god, Mobius. that is so thinly disguised. Uh, they they didn't might do, as well have not they, done it. They could have done M- Morpheus. That would have been They should have done Morpheus. <laughs> Morpheus. Mor- oh my god. Morpheus, Laragorn, and <laughs> what was it? Curlax? Curlax. Curlax. Yeah. <laughs> not to be confused with Culex, the boss from Mario RPG. Very different. I would never okay. confuse that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so these are uh, dream stooges. Dream you said. stooges. They um, kind of like feast on people's like souls and dreams in the world of ruin in R- Final Fantasy VI. I don't know if you all played Final R- Fantasy remember VI. Remember, Curly. Curly's an ironic name. Curly's the bald one. Yeah. yeah, I'm not looking up what the three stooges look like. I'm just gonna draw t- three character heads, and it's, that's gonna be. I them. like that you started with three shapes. Yeah, these are their three <laughs> heads. So there's his character in the in Final Fantasy VI called Cyan, and he has a very hard time of it. He loses his family. Okay. And uh, when the world uh, is destroyed, kind of, he goes back to the castle where everyone he loved was poisoned. Mm-hmm. And there are some like demons, like kind of like tormenting people who try to sleep there. So oh. you go sleep there, and all of a sudden you're kind of like warped into a uh, uh, void, 
I guess, like an, almost like an MC Escher kind of like dungeon. Ooh. And you got to go find find your friends and then uh, fight Larry, Curly, and Moe all together at the same time. Of course you do. <laughs> that's um that's the Green Goblin. Mm-hmm. This is on the, the Green right. Goblin, yeah. Okay. It's very good. Okay. So Here Final Fantasy VI. Final Fantasy VI. American Final Fantasy VI, Japanese Final Fantasy VI. Isn't well, there I mean, a thing the that's thing. three or six? Well, three, six was released as three in America. Yeah. It, was, it went one, two, three, which was actually one, four, six. Okay. Great. But gotcha. it's, it's but just they, called six now. Yeah, they, they, they've flattened that all out recently. Yeah. Okay. No one calls Around the it time they ta- Curly changed to Curlax is when they, <laughs> okay, they straightened that out. <laughs> great. I just wanted to, to make sure that was clear. Mm-hmm. Curlax sounds like if you want very specifically shaped poops, you take it. <laughs> <laughs> Have your Curlax in the morning. Your poo will be curled. <laughs> I didn't ask for this. I don't this. need that. Yeah, I don't need that. I love that. the guile hair we've got going on. For, yeah, we've got uh, guile and yeah, wi- for which Laragorn, I assume none of them are bald. These look like already. <laughs> these already look like the neutrinos from Ninja Turtles. <laughs> now it's a Doug character. This looks so much like a Doug character. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. I think that's <laughs> Judy. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just sort of non plus, just like uh, um, yeah, sort of I, an angry we, Roger with a bad haircut. We know, we know this is weird. This is Dodger Blots, <laughs> <laughs> and this is just Carl Pilkington <laughs> <laughs> with guile hair. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, good. Wow. So, Tristan, why do you want to fight these three? Uh, because you have to save your friend Cyan, mm-hmm. who is like trapped in like the dream world, kind of. Mm-hmm. And these and guys are like, you're not gonna. No. Not without fighting us. So, you gotta kill, apparently, you gotta kill Curlax first because he can revive the other two. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. That's the key. <laughs> that's, the, that's the trick to it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The other two don't have reviving powers, only Curlax. Yeah. Yes, okay. correct. I think Do you so. have to use like finger pokes and 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 do you, you slap your face a bunch and make little noises to okay. power up? Okay, oh, I up see where you're going with that. Your it, really, it really landed. You stuck it. <laughs> nice. Do do one of those. Uh huh. Yep. Do you have to be a wise guy? You no, know, it's actually just oh a Blizzaga. Is you just use you just use Blizzaga. You just use Blizzaga. This oh, is I... a a front view of a fish. Swimming at us. Oh, look at this one. This is very <laughs> Ponyo. I like, yeah. I like the, di- so are they gonna have bodies or are they just sort of three floating dream heads? I mean, I had to establish the heads first. Mm-hmm. Something's wrong with this one. <laughs> the other ones are fine. <laughs> the other ones are fine. Maybe something's wrong with the other two and something's very right with this one. Now, which one, are they just in order from left to right? Is it's a Curlax, uh, Laragorn and Mobius. Yeah. Okay, so Mobius. <laughs> yeah, Mobius has got issues. Uh-huh. Yeah, I got some yeah. things to think you about. You gave him three. You gave Jacob three to do. Yeah, I did. This guy's just kind of got a little, I think he's sitting on the shoulders of the other two. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> so that's he, that's very, got, oh. that's a very Laragorn. That's so Typical Laragorn. Typical Laragorn, classic Larry. Agorn. Uh, yeah, don't don't say Larry. No, it's I Laragorn. Can't. Mm-hmm. Um, and they're they're what do you say they are dream wizards uh, dream stooges dream stooges dream yeah. of course dream stooges mm-hmm. they're the stooges that makes a lot of sense so he's gonna have a little bow tie perfect and some <laughs> suspenders he's gonna be sort of dressed like Casey Green's anime club I have a question about the one in the middle Jacob yes hair or hat mm. hair or hat mm. hat or head hat or head. I don't think you get to know that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, because it looks like hair at the top, but then the way the sideburns go, it sort of looks like it's it's just sort of flopping. Last last time we asked Jacob had her head, it turned out to be like someone like shitting like <laughs> down the middle of someone's chest. So Yeah, what? that's true. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember you that. Were, I'm pretty sure you were there. I must have blacked <laughs> blacked out for that <laughs> bit. Just Jacob, that's erased just Doug's it from outfit. My Jacob. <laughs> 
<laughs> Jacob, that's Doug. <laughs> oh, oh, Curlax. <laughs> you, y'all remember that episode of Doug where everyone wore Doug's outfit because it was very popular one week? I do, do you remember not. any episode of Doug? I do remember several episodes of Doug. I remember. Like the Think Big episode. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember sure. the one where he gets new shoes. Yep. And they're too big. Oh, no. And he thinks he's going to help him play basketball or some yeah. stupid shit. <laughs> Doug was an idiot. What, you, <laughs> you don't like Doug, huh? He was a real just sad sack idiot. <laughs> I'm saying it. I'm coming out strong, a- strong anti-Doug positioning. Doug was just Charlie Brown with an alter ego and less yeah. morals. Le- yeah. <laughs> less, less morals. morals. Well, he Charlie Brown's a... always going on about morals. So yeah, he did have a Snoopy. He did pork chop. Pork, pork chop. chop. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh, he's swole. Oh, look at this thick. Uh-oh. Look at this unit. Uh oh. Mobius. Oh, Mobius no. over here. Mobius not... quickly becoming my favorite. <laughs> More of like the Stooges. Swolbius. More hey. like Swolbius. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> this is his second form. After you defeat <laughs> Curlax and oh, Laragorn. You, you, like, you just start at his feet and then he just like grows more and more swole as you like lift up as you fight his his whole being like Kefka. <laughs> A lot of moods going on here. Yeah, <laughs> they're they're clearly say. good friends with each other. <laughs> yeah. Because nice. the Stooges, you know, canonically did not yeah. like each other very much. They, they would were. always they would hurt each other. Mm-hmm. But it seems like these guys are they've worked past their differences. Mm-hmm. What differences? The dream the dream state. They never had any differences. They've been friends forever. They celebrate their differences. I love the, these guys are icons. The, the arms. Laragorn's arms go behind their necks, and you don't see the hands on the other side. So I can only imagine he's very lightly just sort of just caressing. Kind of caressing, yeah, giving them like a gentle encouraging. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Uh, let me give him some little shoes <laughs> and like a fly. So fancy. <laughs> Amazing. So yeah, you just use Blizzaga on these guys and uh, you take them out <laughs> pretty, pretty easy. Pretty quick. Yeah. They're just three dudes. They're just, <laughs> they're just three guys in the dream world. <laughs> yeah, what are they going to do? No, no shirt on Mobius, huh? No, 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 okay. no shirt is big enough. Yeah, definitely not. He worked so hard on that bod. Just Don't cover in. it up. Let's take a look. Oh. Oh, they're like little guys. The little rotten boys. The little rotten boys. Oh, they're just a, three little assholes, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Two of them are like people, and one of them is is like a, a who. Like, yeah, yeah, they are very like who who villain. Mm-hmm. Wow. Cool. And oh, they're just three little boys. They, they just, yeah. It's what, <laughs> it's that thing in Final Fantasy where they appear as like very generic sprites like in the overworld, but when you get to the bosses, they're like very detailed gremlin children. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, these look like creepy toys that would have been in like a cousin's bedroom. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. These do yeah. look like dream stooges though. I'll give them yeah. that. Yeah. That is true. They're like toys from some sort of like local fast food chain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, <laughs> yeah, they really are. <laughs> What's a McBurger? <laughs> <laughs> oh, amazing. Um, I guess I'm done then. Yeah. yeah. Julia, do you want to hop in? Yep. I'm nervous about this one. Mm. All right. Just for you. Oh, good. Tristan, I'm ready for that one then. You're ready, Julia. Yes. Your Final Fantasy boss is Demon Wall. Demon Wall. Demon Wall. Uh, also known as Evil Wall. Is that helpful? <laughs> Demon Wall. Demon Wall, Evil Wall. This Gonna have not... to do some some three point perspective on that wall. That, that's <laughs> the, the most evil wall of all. <laughs> <laughs> Making artists have to Demon <laughs> draw, wall. draw planes in perspective. Mm-hmm. Demon wall. Just draw a square with an angry face in it. <laughs> and I think we can call this a day. I think, yeah, is, is that is that Thwomp? Yeah, he's kind of like yeah. a demon Thwomp. wall. You can even go thwimp if you want. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. this let's is get, a wall that's part of yeah. part of a room. Good. So if you go there into this go. room, <laughs> there's demon wall. There's demon wall. Oh, Just don't go gosh. over to it. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, hey, come over here. Hey. Uh, I don't think so. No, you got to. I don't think I do. Yeah, you're, you're God, you got to come over here. here. I'm a demon wall. Seem, yeah, it's, it does seem that way, which is a, one of the reasons. I'm going to fight you. You just got to get a little closer. Well, the thing about the, uh, the demon wall is one of those like crushing room bosses. You know, it's in a lot of Final Fantasy games. Is that which one's this one from? 
Uh, it's from like four. It's in seven. A version of it is in seven. A version of it is in fourteen. I think. Wow, okay. this was a, a a good boss design. I guess they really they, <laughs> they were really like, oh, we, we didn't well, we, we didn't really wall. get the the full. We didn't fully explore Demon Wall yeah, and all it could back accomplish. To Demon yeah, wall. can we uh, can we pick up Demon Wall again? <laughs> think, think of it like like a living version of like the Star Wars like garbage compactor. Right. Yeah. Okay. Sure. And it's like except for like you know it's like and there was also a boss kind of like that in uh, Secret of Mana. You ever play that? I did play it. You remember that wall? I played Where it a long time ago. The boss is like a wall. Ago. The wall boss. Anyone? I, I don't remember that. Just me, huh? I'm sorry. <laughs> but it basically like slowly comes towards you and attacks you, and you have to beat it in time. Yeah, it, there's like, a lot of those in all kinds of games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Contra's got some pretty oh, yeah. pretty mean walls mm-hmm, in it. Mm-hmm. Demon wall. My God. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so is it like a timed boss fight sort of deal where you have to like... Beat it in time. Like It'll try to slow you down. You can cast slow on it. In a lot of the versions, you cast slow on the wall, so it comes at you slower. Oh, that's nice. But it'll still, I mean, it'll crush you to death. Yeah, but, will, sl- but slower. Right, but sl- a little bit slower, a little bit slower. I think I'd want that to happen faster mm-hmm. if I had to make a choice. It does show up in uh, Final Fantasy VII. I think it's it, it's the last boss fight and last fight, I think, where you can play as uh, Aerith before uh, <laughs> something happens. Her her real swan song battle <laughs> against <laughs> Demon Wall. It's one know. that really makes you say, man, I don't know what I'd do without... I, I say Eris. I use the American. I mean, it's not even American anymore because they use Aerith and like like Kingdom Hearts and stuff. Yeah, but it's really just bad. What do you mean, Aerith? I mean, I don't Aerith? like. I'm, I'm not saying I like sa- it. I'm saying yeah, it's a I'm standard. saying it sounds bad and it looks bad as a word and like it sounds Aris? bad as a word. Aer- I don't know. Eris sounds better and nicer. Mm-hmm. And I will not budge from this. <laughs> Aerith. I- I mean, you might have to if you want to play the the new the remake. I can just pretend that they're saying Eris. <laughs> yeah, just every time. I'll like, scream it the over the top. Hundreds of times they say. <laughs> you <it>. just get, <laughs> yeah. Just make a loud S sound. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we've got uh, sort of a, a demon man. I have a feeling this wall is just a wall, isn't it? It's just like a brick wall. It's probably just a brick wall. Yeah, but you're doing something. Who's this it's guy? It's a demon wall. It's, it is a demon wall, yeah. You have a demon here. I do. Is it his what's wall? He, what's he got there? Well, I think. Mm-hmm. Walk us through it. What? Walk us through your. Oh, top, your, I thought top. you were asking me to walk you through this wall. Like, <laughs> walk us through this wall. I literally can't do that. <laughs> That's what they're for. They're demon wall. <laughs> okay, so he's got sort of like a a spear. Is he a pull, like a pole? A pole. Did he slide down it like a like a fire like a fire department? <laughs> Situation. We need answers, Julia. I, I'm i trying, I'm all my focus is on trying to figure out what I'm doing. I don't know how to explain it to you if I don't know what I'm doing. I thought of, and I can't think of exactly what it's called. I think it's called The Gates of Hell. Mm-hmm. It was a piece made in the Renaissance. Oh. Yeah, and it's a big relief <laughs> door, and it's huge, and yeah. it is just about all of these like demons in hell. And it's a it's a big relief of all these demons just writhing mm-hmm. in hell, mm-hmm. and uh, it was just like some doors that were in Italy for a little while. Uh, why, why don't you just like do a Renaissance real quick? Yeah, listen, so I didn't yeah, say I, think, I was smart. We got it. We're just doing a mono. You and may have doing a Renaissance. <laughs> may have uh, gone for a bit of a complicated interpretation. Uh huh. Of yeah. the demon wall. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, you know, the <laughs> Michelangelo like. Would show his sketches to people, and they'd be like, "Well, you're gonna you're gonna sculpt all of that in 3D." And he was like, "Well, no, it's just gonna be sort of up against a, a flat surface coming out of it." And they'd go, "Oh, that's a relief." God <laughs> damn it, Nathan! You know, it's better than like I thought. I really thought he was gonna go for a Ninja Turtles reference there, so uh, I guess we we're all safe from that. I, I guess that's an improvement. <laughs> Amazing! Uh. Amazing! I really uh. liked it. I did. I guess it was a good joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't think it was, but it was it was fine. The fact that she had just recently said relief and you still didn't <laughs> didn't know where I was going I didn't with see it, it was coming. Pretty good. Oh my god. I really yeah. I goofed it, huh? 
I've made a mistake. If it helps, in Final Fantasy XIV, you can get a tiny demon wall pet called a demon brick. Oh, <laughs> that's great! That helps me. That makes me happy. Yeah, I want. I like thinking about that. <laughs> yeah, let's all think about the demon brick. So this wall, I'm guessing, just has moves much like a thwomp of just crush. Yeah, it, it will. It. I think it just the gets room, closer to yeah. you until it crushes you. Oh, I'd name my demon brick. Richard. Based on Tristan saying that's exactly what it did, that'd be my guess as to what it does. You know I haven't been listening. I'm in a panic. <laughs> You're in a panic drawing these very detailed, this is cool. Thank Julia, you. this is cool. <laughs> Thank you. You're just drawing an ornate wall. Yeah. Yeah. What else do you want an, from me? An ornate demon wall. Okay. This is great. I'd watch this. I'd watch this. <laughs> I'd let this kill me slowly, yeah. <laughs> painfully. They're like, oh, look at the, look at the attention to detail on the. Oh, ow! <laughs> oh, it's, it's, oh my god! Oh, it's really close. My oh my god! Oh. Bit too close up. I forgot to class slow. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> so one of my favorite designs of any boss in Final Fantasy is the one that's in whatever the one that Lightning's in. What's that one? Thirteen. Thirteen. And or also do you mean lightning, lightning returns? returns. Lightning no, I returns. mean the original one. The one with Orphan. Orphan's design is just wild. I don't know why you remember the design of any boss from Final Fantasy 13. I because I don't because remember Orphan's design is just wild. Game. Orphan's design Orphan's uh theme song is one of my favorite Final Fantasy songs. Is it This Is Halloween again? Uh <laughs> it's certainly not. <laughs> it's a pretty good song. Yeah, they should definitely use it more often. <laughs> Every boss. Yeah. It's like, this Halloween. This Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it's like Sephiroth. Sephiroth, Sephiroth. Sephiroth. <laughs> <Wing and angel. laughs> this is a cool wall, Julia. You're getting a lot of... Lot, adding oh, a lot wow. of lines so here. It's too. like they they sculpted the fire into the wall. So yeah, it's all, yeah. Because they get real detailed. The design in in Orphan's thing is he's like a clock sword. Oh, cool! And he has <laughs> so many stupid little details, mm -hmm. and I love it. It's and, so it, it reminds me of like that Heavenly Bodies Met Gala thing. Oh, back to that. Yeah, it's very stupid, and I love it. I'd get crushed by this wall for yeah, sure. Yeah, cool, cool wall. Yeah, cool. you know when when I see on the internet people say "step on me" and to this wall I say "crush me." Crush me. Crush me. Yeah. Uh, should I look up this demon yeah. wall? Is there one in particular you want me to look up? Uh, no. Just see what see what comes up. Demon wall, Final Fantasy. Oh. Oh boy, that's a one. <laughs> I didn't go or need enough. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> well, they, you didn't know the wall was gonna have arms and swords and a bunch of legs. You could have guessed. <laughs> a lot of them are different. Some of them are like kind of like almost like a Freddy Krueger situation, where some of them are like melting coming out of the wall. Yeah, let's oh, see I another like one. That. Yeah, the sword. The sword wall is really the. Ooh, that one's fun. <laughs> that was just like somebody's deviant art drawing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you can, you can customize the wall be crushed by any drawing you want. Oh, I like them. Well, I like some of these. They're fun. It's just a monster coming out a wall. <laughs> it's like yeah. encased in carbonite. But I like I like the one that has way too many swords. And I, like all of, all of these demon walls are more polite than yours because they at least have the courtesy to look at you while they're crushing you. These, yeah. right. these demons look like they're just having a conversation <laughs> they don't even with care. each other as they, they crush you. They have an argument and they just start stabbing their spears yeah. into the ground. <laughs> Do you think... Uh, Mom said, <laughs> I could have a go. <laughs> could have a go. Her. You know we both go every time. No, I want to have the go. <laughs> if you go, I go. I can't, you can't go without me. No, Mom said it was my turn we to- We don't have a mom. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Our mom is Lilith. It's everyone's mom. <laughs> uh, demon wall. Demon, demon wall. wall. There it is. I've Oof. done something. This was great. Final Fantasy. Go, I'm, go play one of them, why don't you? I'm gonna go play Tactics Advance again, because- You can play I, any I, of them on like any it. platform, except for Final Fantasy VIII, which is apparently banished. Yeah, that one's in the shadow realm now. <laughs> um, but you can play seven or nine or 10 or, or 12. Advance. Or adv Tactics on the, Advance. On the Switch. On yeah. The Nintendo Game Boy. We're not Game being sponsored, Boy. let's be, be clear about that, right? No. No. Okay. I, I wish. Let's end the episode. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're sorry. 
We're sorry. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry. Hey, thanks for watching that episode of Drawfee. If you like Drawfee and the stuff we make, the best way to support us is by signing up for Dropout. For around the cost of a jug of mouthwash a month, you get access to Drawfee episodes a week early, as well as a exclusive Dropout Discord where you can chat with me. And you get access to the Dropout exclusive shows like Cartoon Hell, I Made That Show, I'm um, Actually, which I was on, and Rank Room, which I was also on. It's a good time. Start your free trial. Go to dropout.tv. Please. Please.